I was hesitant before I published the article because I start to think about people who have done this in the past and the consequences. And I didn't know the response I would get from the business leaders, all those people that I do business with for so many years and help me to be successful. And then I realized that I have a voice that nobody else in this country has. The first call I got was from the CEO of one of the largest banks in the country. He said, Wes, I'm really sorry. How can I help? So after getting a number of these calls, I say to folks, why don't we do this? Why don't we use a business approach to solving this social problem? Let's start this group called the Canadian Council of Business Leaders Against Anti-Black Systemic Racism. And because that's a mouthful, let's call it the Black North Initiative. Uh, we're using a Canadian solution to solve a social problem. They said, because we've done it. We're doing it right now. We're doing it with COVID-19. We had to act collectively as business leaders. We couldn't do it in isolation. And all of a sudden, the economy starts to open up and we're seeing results from our collective action. Let's use the same approach to solve this problem of anti-Black systemic racism, not to solve racism, but to look at the barriers that exist and try to remove them. 